Ben with Carter PT here again. One of the most common questions we get in the clinic is, especially with our runners, is how should I strike my foot when I land on the ground? And that's kind of honestly a difficult question to ask. We're all built differently, we're all put together differently, and we're going to kind of move differently. But one thing we want to take a look at on running form is that make sure that people aren't hitting their foot in extremes. And what I mean by that is we want to make sure people are not hitting their heel in extreme. If we see this, often what we see above is that the knee is really straight. And we know the forces that go through the knee would be tremendous. And if somebody is running constantly on their forefoot here, that puts a lot of strain on their calf. But the reality is that there's a lot in between here in the striking pattern. The heel has a fat pad and it's designed to absorb shock. So striking in your heel is not necessarily a bad thing. So what we wanna look for is that make sure that people are able to appropriate forces to their body correctly. And if you happen to be a severe heel striker or severe forefoot striker, that's something of concern. But what I'm really looking for is what is your knee doing up above? That's way more important than your foot. And you see all these different types of shoe types out there with zero drop, two millimeter, six millimeter, or 12 millimeter, and there's a big difference in it. I don't think that makes a huge difference. I think it's about finding a shoe that works well for you in supporting your body and making sure your running form is nice and fluid. If it's not, it's worth a concern. But what we're really concerned with is are people appropriating forces to their body correctly? And can they push off and they drive really well? And if they can't, then it's worth taking a look at. So if you're interested in that, we offer a high speed running analysis at 120 frames per second which allows us to go into extreme detail as far as what problems are you having with your running form. If you've always wondered, what's wrong with my running form? How can I improve it? Maybe you've never even had an injury. This could be a great option to look at to say, how can I become a faster runner, a more efficient runner? And we can provide those tools for you. So if you have any more questions, go to carterpt.com and take a look at our website. Thank you. Take care.